Welcome back to the channel, everybody. Zami here with episode 22 of the Fallout 4 playthrough. Last episode, if you missed it, we got all the lights hooked up in Sanctuary here. All our uh, power conduits and everything reorganized. Got rid of the mess out here so we can plant more crops. Got our generator hooking up our siren now. And we moved all of our power armor to those power armor stations right over there. We went ahead, we gave uh, Sturgis the... Um, hollow tape from the Institute. It didn't do anything other than uh, give us a perk point from leveling us up. And we went ahead and got Ninja rank 4. Got to be level 38 to get rank 5. So this is essentially the last one we're going to be getting in that. Uh, I want to start the episode off here by returning to Father and completing Synth Retention. And then I also want to go continue the castle quest line so let's hook up the map head right on down to the institute talk to father and then head on over to the castle boom into the institute People in the let's head on upstairs here and talk to father get this xp from this mission real quick oof i think he's up one more floor Weird that he's up here. He's usually not. I'm glad to see you return safely. I know the task was difficult, but I needed you to see firsthand how dangerous a rogue synth can be. Gabriel and his gang were sick bastards, hanging their victims up like trophies. I'm just glad it's over. While we can do nothing for Gabriel's victims, we can at least take comfort in the knowledge that the threat has been removed. But enough about that. The task is done. And you've returned our synth safely to us. I couldn't have hoped for a better outcome. Uh, well done. While you were away, I had quarters prepared for you. You'll find all the basic necessities, as well as a generous stock of arms and equipment. Go and have a look. I think you'll be quite pleased. Perfect! I forgot he did that. Let's go take a look at our new quarters. Where the hell are they? See, this is the true question. Ah, up here. You must be very proud. Sir, we had another situation. Cold red. What? This is the third time in two weeks. This is unacceptable. Okay. I am kind of bummed that Nick can't come into the institution with you. Just because he's a synth, it makes a little bit of sense. In the meantime, tell the others to be uh, Hello. Your quarters are just inside, sir. Thank you. Right away, sir. If you see anything even remotely suspicious... When you're finished here, sir, Father wants to see you. Ooh, an institute lab coat. Understood. Clean room suit. The Battle of Bunker Hill. Okay, we're going to wait on that mission, actually. So this is the last mission we're going to do for the Institute for a while. Because I want to get a weapon from the railroad called the Deliverer. And that weapon will allow me... Uh, it basically just uses less VATS points, or less AP. Alright, let's head on out of here. I want to head, like I said before, I want to head over to the castle. See what's going on over there. Alright, let's see, where's the... There he is. Uh -uh. There she is. Yeah, there you are, <laughs> finally. I've been waiting to talk to you. Who are you? I'm Ronnie Shaw, Commonwealth Minutemen. At least I was. Back before Joe Becker got himself killed and the idiots took over. Glad to meet you. We can use some more veterans around here. Ah, well, you're right about that. I feel like some of these you've got still may need their diapers changed. Get to the point. I've been trying to. 
Heard you were trying to get the Minutemen back on their feet. Thought I'd come see the new general for myself. So what's your story? What makes you think anybody even wants the Minutemen back? Um, the fact that we're helping? At least we're trying to help people. Can you say the same? Don't give me any attitude, Sonny. I've been a Minuteman longer than you've been alive. But I've heard some good things about what you've been doing. Wouldn't be here otherwise. Now that I'm here, I can see you really need my help. Are you offering to rejoin? I guess I am, but first things first. I'm probably the only one who still remembers this. But the castle's armory was located in the West Bastion. All of our best equipment was stored in there. Weapons, ammo, schematics, you name it. Come on, I'll show you. Okay. Oh, yeah, that's this thing. We gotta put power to it and then it'll open. I think, if I remember correctly. Ah, huh. good. Looks like it might still be intact. Door still sealed. Bastion hasn't collapsed. Trick now is finding a way in. Do you know some way to open this door? No. And even if we could blast it open, we'd probably destroy what's inside while we're at it. If you can't go through, go around. Let's have a look at the northeast bastion. Sure thing. Just following Ronnie around here. This is Radio Freedom, broadcasting all day, all across the Commonwealth. Nothing to report. Stay safe out there, everyone. I wish they walked faster, like... Holy... Yeah, I like how it's already got conduits and wire and everything already ran through the whole facility. Makes it super nice. Was the general's quarters there used to be a tunnel leading from here to the armory? Hmm, the tunnel's blocked by this rubble. We'll have to find some way to clear it. Okay, what's this now? Oh, did it bring me? It did. Okay, <laughs> it brought me all the way over here. Let's get down there and see if there's still a way through. Yes, let's. In we go. Okay. It's like the under area of the castle. Uh, pretty dark down here. We better watch our steps. So, this is what two centuries without a good dusting looks like. Ronnie, did you just walk past all these mines? Your pip boy doesn't sound pleased. What say we get out of here? <laughs> doesn't look like the mire lurks made it down here. Now Ow! Um, why do you think that is? Okay, we're back out. <clears throat> let's get... Let's get these hooked up to our slot here. And then I wonder, do I have actual... I do. Okay, perfect. When did it get this quiet? About the time the giant robot man woke up. Movement detected. Sentry bot. Designation. Sarge. Powering up. Well, I'll keep. I would have Let's get this over with. That sucks. <laughs> Security 
Okay, got your leg. <coughs> ah! Okay, holy crap. He's been guarding the castle since uh, forever, as far as I know. What is this? Oh, okay, I thought that was like a weapon. Okay, moving on. Go ahead, uh, Ronnie. Let's see. I used to know this password. One if I land. Nah, that's not it. For the Commonwealth. Ah, darn it. Oh, it's been a long time. United we stand. Yeah, that was it. Uh... General McGann. Ooh, a general's hat and uniform. Hell yes. Oh, that explains all the landmines. This is, well, was, General McGann. He had your job back when I first joined up. Must have gotten trapped down here when that sea beast attacked the castle. Ah, uh, he did manage to keep the armory secure. I'll give him that much. Ah, guess the uniform is yours now, if you want it. So Geezer doesn't need it anymore. Rest it. Let's hook it up, actually. Let's look at it. Oh, no, maybe that's why it's got so much damage. That happened 40 years stuff. ago. Come on, we're almost through. Cool. Okay. Into the armory we go. Four crank laser musket capacitor. Sorry, yeah, I got in here and everything was, uh... No way she just opened the door. She did, okay. That sucks. There we go. Told you I'd get us in here. Now, let's see what kinds of goodies are left. Literally everything. Medium scope. And a beam splitter. You building a collection or something? I am. Excellent. The armory's still intact. Everything we need, just waiting for us. You found the schematics for building artillery, right? I just did. Don't forget your mini nuke. Where'd Ronnie go? There she is. I have to admit, Ronnie, having artillery would help out quite a bit. Oh, we used to rain down fire on death claws and super mutants alike. It was a glorious thing. Okay. Hey, here's what I've got. Perfect. I just need you to take something. That'll do. Thanks, Nick. <clears throat> Alright, where do I hook the artillery up, Ronnie? She walks so slow.
Hey there. Ah, looks like you've got everything we need. As soon as you get some artillery built, we'll do a test fire to calibrate it. Get some artillery built? Okay, let's hook up the workshop, I guess. Special at it. Oh! Let's go. Okay, I'm gonna cut that out. Uh, it took me a while to figure out what the game exactly wanted me to do. There we go, that looks better. Oh! Okay, but I figured it out. Uh, it doesn't say and assign when you first uh, get the plans for the artillery. But I've got it now. Let's talk back to Ronnie and fire our test shots. <clears throat> ah, gosh darn, it's good to see artillery here again. Now, here's the thing about the big guns. They can't fire at anything too close, but their range is impressive. That's what the smoke grenades are for. Toss one of those at the bad guy. If we have artillery in range, we'll confirm over the radio and target our fire on your smoke. But first, we better do a test fire. Make sure we're hitting what we're aiming at. You see that little building over there? We'll use that for our aiming point. Keep your radio on and tuned to Radio Freedom so we can confirm we're ready. Head to the target area. Okay, let's go. Artillery, smoke grenade. What little building was she talking about? It, I mean, it's got to be this one, right? Yeah. Well, come on, then. Fire. Boom. Come on, then. Holy. Cool. We shot another one. Let's go. Firing a third, there it goes. I've been told the Valentine Detective Agency signs are an eyesore. But they sure bring in the Holy business. cow! How many shots are you gonna fire? I think we're really starting to make a difference. I think so too. Now that we have the armory back, you can resupply here whenever you run low on supplies. Anything you need right now? Let me see what you've got. Here's uh, what we have on hand. Oh. So I get a better... Yeah, I get better prices here. Fifty cal sniper rifles. Holy oh, eighty six three oh eight rounds. Holy. That looked like Preston Garvey for a second. That's our next uh, little stage in this. Let's see though. I have. So right now I have the Minuteman General's hat and the General's uniform. And we're going to see... I'm going to swap these out for our actual armor and see what the difference is from 45 and 80. So I'm only losing 6 damage without the helmet. This is 
or with the helmet, and I'm gaining 25 electric damage. Huh. Well, that's weird. That's actually something to think about. Let's head back to Preston, though, and finish up this mission. Okay. Preston Garvey, where are you at, Chief? Oh. We better put on the General's outfit to talk to him. Boom. I've got to hand it to you, General. You've really turned things around for the Minutemen. I never thought I'd see the day that the Minutemen had artillery support again. We should see about building them at all our settlements to expand our coverage. And Ronnie Shaw returns. She's something else, isn't she? She is. Yeah, she definitely knows how to take charge. Ha, that's a bit of an understatement from what I hear. I'd heard stories about her from the old timers, but I didn't know she was still around. The fact that she's come back to the Minutemen means we must be doing something right. I'll let you know if I hear of any settlements that need our help. In the meantime, make sure to offer help to anyone that needs it. That can only help our cause. Perfect. So does that mean that I can hook up... Oh, no way. You can hook up artillery at Sanctuary? Okay, that's unfair. There we go. I need a new settler to put on this eventually, but that'll do for now. Alrighty, guys. Hooked up the uh, artillery over at the castle. Got Ronnie Shaw. Opened the armory. Talked to Preston. And got the ability to set these up at every settlement in the game. That's actually nuts. Uh, next episode, we are going to head down to uh, the Old North Church. Or we're actually going to do two things. Bring the serum to Virgil, and we're going to head to the Old North Church and do our first railroad mission. As always, ladies and gentlemen, thanks for watching the episode. Don't forget, like and subscribe. And as always, I hope you have a great night.